You said that one of the reasons why you participated in the home run derby was to fix your swing. Um, do you feel that, that you accomplished that goal? I think so, yeah. I mean, I've been feeling great after the, the home run derby and everything. Even in the All-Star game, I feel great. My swing was right there. I follow up a couple balls and it feels, it feels right. So I think, yeah, I think so. Okay. And um, I noticed that you decided to go with a left-handed pitcher in the home run derby. Why did you do that? I mean, uh, we have three pitching, uh, three BP, no three, we have a lot of BP throwers in the team. Uh, but all, all three hitting coaches I picked uh, K Long because I know he he won't get scared, he throw the ball right there. Yeah. He's gonna be on time every time and I, I think it's gonna be a great experience for him. And I feel great with him. Okay. And um, what what size bat do you use when you hit? I know it's a random question, but do you like a heavy bat, a lighter bat? I mean, I I always tell the guys I use uh, my broomstick. <laughs> I like I like to be skinny and uh, and comfortable, really good balance. That's that's what the kind of bats I like. It. Jugaba vitilla cuando era chiquito. Yeah, a lot. Por eso, you feel more comfortable. <laughs> yeah, with it? I mean, yeah. <laughs> I think maybe it come from there. We always played vitilla when I was a kid, and we use uh, the broomstick. And I think that's where it comes from. Okay, now some random questions. Um, una de las cosas que me encanta más de, de cómo tú juegas is that you're very confident. It's, at least it appears that way. Do you feel very confident when you go up to the plate? And uh, do you feel like you're going to dominate the pitcher? Is that your goal when you go up there? Always, always. Every time I go to the plate, I always think it on my way. I always believe in myself. Uh, I think that's why maybe people think uh, I was confident because I always believe in myself. Every time I, I'm on the plate, no matter who's throwing, I'm going to believe in myself. I'm going to bet on me. Yeah. And, um, you do the Soro Shimmy. Yo, yo digo que eso es bailando perico ripiado <laughs> para mí. ¿De right. dónde salió eso? Soro Shuffle, it came when I was in the minor leagues. Uh, I just taking pitches, I feel so excited. And I think that's one of the ways to get myself pumped up and ready to go. And yeah, I think that's that's where it comes from. Okay, and when, una o dos más y ya terminamos. When you go up to the plate, I notice a lot of guys talking about that they don't want to change their approach. Do you ever change your approach depending on the count or the pitcher or anything like that? No, not at all. I mean, uh, I do my two strike approach, but uh, I was thinking the same way. I was sitting on the fastball, punting the fastball as, as long as I can. Uh, it don't matter if you throw a lot of sliders, I'm going to be hunting the fastball. Um, what kind of music do you like? I like everything. I hear everything. I don't, I don't I don't like anything in specific, I just like everything. Yeah, is there anything you listen to before a game to pump you up or anything like that? I mean, it can be whatever. It can be merengue, it can be rock, it can be hip hop, whatever. But I, I hear something that like, got me pumped up. Okay, ultima pregunta. If you weren't a ball player, where do you think you would be right now? I think mean, I think of times, I don't know, I just, I, I, I think it's something around baseball. I mean, something got me close to baseball because I love the game. My company aims to amplify Latino voices, to, to, to reach a, a Latino audience, especially in baseball because there's so many Latino ball players. Do you have any advice for Latinos out there who, you know, are looking, are looking to hear what Juan Soto has to say to make them feel like they can achieve their goals? I mean, it never, it, it's never give up. It's always believe in yourself, always trust in yourself. Pray a lot and always work hard. I mean, like, like Derek did say, can be players with more talent than you, but nobody can work harder than you. So just keep working hard. No matter how many how many things they told you that you can, whatever, just believe in yourself and keep working hard. Was he your favorite player, Derek Jeter? No. Who was your favorite player? Was Manny Ramirez and Oh, okay. Okay, fun. Mucho gusto, man. Muchas gracias. Un placer.